Good morning, humanity. It is September 13th, 2021, and it's most favorite time of our week because it's Mondays with Bev and Paul. And today we are celebrating <laughs> happy yeah, anniversary. Yeah. And it is a marvelous, <laughs> incredible day because today... Bev is here! Oh, I get to hug you! <laughs> Yay! Oh. oh my god, what a great way to start our five year anniversary. Oh, no. And this wow. is it, this is the way we started. It is. You know? Only it, I had a, a little bit more heads up because that very first show. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so we want to take just a few minutes here and we want to go through the past four years of our shows, just a little clip of each one. And then we're going to hang out with you and talk a lot about what, what's in the plan here for this following year. And yeah. It's awesome. I mean, it's like, oh my God, there's a real human being. I know. <laughs> I know. I never thought that was going to happen. Yeah. I'm so happy. All right. So uh, let's show you a little bit of the past. I know you have heard these beautiful words Love thy neighbor as thyself Using BioTouch will help Okay, here we are. Hi, Beth. Here we are. Hi, Paul. <laughs> Good morning. Welcome, everybody. This is our first uh, live uh, stream. You can relax, Beth. I'm going to try. <laughs> so I need BioTouch. <laughs> <laughs> So, hi everyone. Uh, we're going to do uh, Bev and Paul every Monday. Oh, I guess I should look at the camera. <laughs> so, what do you have to say this morning? Well, first of all, I didn't know we were going to do this this morning, so <laughs> this is quite a way to get my day started, right? I'm excited though. I'm excited for you and I to really hold a space of love and to share this amazing gift that uh, it's time. It's time that we get the word out about BioTouch. For sure. So we're going to try and do this every Monday at 10 a.m. Tucson time. And uh... <laughs> here we are. <laughs> happy Labor Day, but more oh, important, happy, happy anniversary. anniversary. Woohoo! My goodness, a year already. A year. There it is. Crazy. Happy one year anniversary to Bev and Paul for their yep. Monday show. Right. Awesome, and we're going to let our guests blow out the candle. Okay. Woohoo! <laughs> we'll get to that later. Good morning, humanity. It is September 3rd, 2018, and this is Mondays with Bev and Paul, and we have a very special day today. It's happy birthday time. <laughs> oh, two years since we've been live, and we are just going to have a great time for... Do, 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 do. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> You're nuts. Woohoo! Happy birthday. And Happy we're birthday hoping that we're us. online here because we can't see it, but we're recording it so it'll go on one way or the other. All right. <laughs> Happy birthday, everybody. It's th been two, two years. Two years. Didn't we start out this way? We started out with problems. We're still having problems. <laughs> We don't have a green screen behind us because Bev wore green in her shirt and you could see through her. <laughs> yeah, this is good. This is good. This is we'll good. Just, we'll just so we're it. back to where we were a couple years ago with our nice little BioTouch sign mm. behind us. Well, congratulations. You too for yes, showing sir. up, what, every Monday? For, every Monday I can't for believe two years. That. I know. That's that was exactly. Julie's idea, by the way. Julie's idea. Thanks, Julie. We appreciate all your help and uh, dedication to this. <laughs> and, and she said, you know, just five or ten minutes. Just get up. So we're going to have a great show today. It's our two-year anniversary. Again, let's show it to you. Happy birthday. We've been live for two years. Good morning, humanity. It's September 2, 2019, and it's another day with Bev and Paul. And good morning, everybody. My name's Paul. Hello. My name's Bev. Good morning. Hi, Bev. Hi, Paul. Good to see How you again. You? <laughs> It's funny just looking at space and trying to picture you as a hologram. <laughs> I know, exactly. <laughs> we'll get good at this. Yeah, we will. <laughs> Pretty soon we'll actually merge and I'll go on that screen and you'll come on this screen. <laughs> exactly. Whoa. <laughs> Good 
Good morning, humanity. Here we are. And uh, this is Mondays with Bev and Paul. And my name's Paul. And hi, my <laughs> name's Bev. And, and Bev's trying to figure out what she's doing over there. I know. <laughs> Hang on just a second. Oh, there I am. <laughs> <laughs> hey everybody! As you can tell, we're got, we're figuring out the glitches in our new um, format. Yes, yes, yes because it's been three years, and this is our third year anniversary, and yeah. we are just so jazzed to have this whole new format. December seventh, it's twenty twenty still, and it's one of the favorite times of your week. And it has been for the past four years because <laughs> happy anniversary! Hey, let's just blow out the candle and make a wish. All right, she's got the cake up. Let me turn over. Give us the countdown, Bev. One, two, three. <sighs> Woohoo! Big wishes for everybody. Yay! Four years. Four years. Can you believe it? Here we are out in the ozone here. We've been out there for four years. Well, wait a minute. We were there four years ago. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. Wow. Memory lane, folks. <laughs> I'm telling you. Come full circle. It's come incredible. Circle. And here we are again, sitting side by side. Side by side. And you know, <laughs> the number five is a very auspicious number, by really? the way. Really? It is. It is. Because what... This foundation is about what? Bring in BioTouch to humanity, and that number is about humanity. Wow. That five, yep. There you go. So it's five, you know, which actually means we're beginning our sixth year. That's right, and what is this year? 2021 is five, if you oh, add yeah, it up. yeah, right, right. So Ooh. this is, I know. We're double five. It's, it's like we're getting this out to humanity. This is the beginning of this new cycle. Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah we're so we're, we're here with you. We've been here every week, every week for the past five years. We have. Even when one of us was not there, right. the other one still came and up. showed up and had some lovely guests over the years, yes, haven't we? we have. Oh, my goodness. And we're still looking for guests. If you'd like yeah. to be a guest on the Mondays with Bev and Paul, let us know. Oh, that would be awesome. If you have questions for the show, let us know. We would love to you know, answer any questions that you have. Yeah. But uh, we, if you have a question today, go ahead and put it in the, uh, you know, we, we actually have Deedams here from Turkey with us. Oh, hi. Hi, Deedam. Hi, Deedam. <laughs> We're going to see her tomorrow. Yes, we are. The whole gang out there in Turkey. So uh, we'd like to see all of you. Uh, our goal is to really get this out to people, oh, isn't it? Yeah. So we thought we would read again our mission and vision statement, and then we're going to ask Bev, you know, as the president, now that she's back again, it's so hard to believe that there's a human being to touch I here. I know. <laughs> I'm so happy. <laughs> so let's read our mission and vision statement, and uh, I'll read it since you don't have your glasses on. I, okay. Our mission to teach BioTouch as a unique, natural approach to alleviate pain and stress and support good health through all stages of life. Our vision, to encourage all people to take responsibility for their own health care, empower them to assist others, and create a community of people worldwide dedicated to service, self-awareness, and recognizing the equality of all humanity thus forming a chain which shall go on indefinitely. So, you know, when you break that up and you just focus on some key words, that whole vision statement it encapsulates exactly what's going on right now. You know, the words community, humanity, equality, taking responsibility, all of these are thought forms that are starting to permeate the, the collective consciousness of humanity. It's like this, where else are we going to go? <laughs> where else? Let's try something different. Uh, okay, let's try, let's try to be who we really are. Yes, that's inspiring in these times. Yeah. And uh, that's been our goal the whole time that we've done these shows. Uh, and now that Bev's back in Arizona, 
Uh, she hasn't quite figured out yet. If you live in Arizona and have a little guest house for her, let us know. She's looking. Yeah. <laughs> it's mostly in the high desert area. And, uh, sh and she's going to step into the space now. And so things have changed. You know, we're down to only having one room yeah. of sessions. Right. Uh, we've moved the office into this part of our building. And we have a nice meeting space now oh, where the curtains beautiful. close from the street. I'm impressed. So, yeah, it's it's time for this next phase. You yeah. know? So if five is the number of serving humanity, of, of humanity, it, we're ready to serve. You know, we're ready to bring this to everyone. And now that we've learned how to do virtual trainings, I mean, those really oh. go well. I mean, we just had somebody from Australia. I know. I'm excited about I don't think we talked about, about that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that, uh, uh, Deborah got up at 2 a.m. in the morning. And she hung in there with us the she, whole day. She actually looked more alive I, at the end of it than we did. did. <laughs> I kept going, wait a minute, she, she's looking more and more. You know, she's watching the sun come up. Right. You know, and uh, that was really amazing to have her with us. So, so we're here. This is it. This is a huge transformation. I can't believe that you stepping in here today was our anniversary. I mean, that's... <laughs> When you look at that first that first video yeah. and the two of us, you know, just hanging out together in yeah, that little office, here we are in a little office it's still hanging still out together. Still hanging out after five years. And you know, um, I don't know, I'm just excited. I, I, I feel like I took a sabbatical. Like I had to go to this other place for two years to um, reset myself. Uh, to prepare for something because um, the fact that I am back in Arizona um, I, I realize now I I don't think I was ever intended to be gone permanently from Arizona because hmm. when I came back here it's I love the high desert it just it just lifts me you know and um, coming into the center and having everything like here we're just right. here Everything that we do is in this one, this little heart center for the planet. And all of us who are still here and have been uh, during this, this uh, time of shifting and, and uh, isolation. And, but, you know, what has it done for all of us? Not just for humanity itself and other groups, but we can tell this amazing board that, that really runs this foundation has just stepped it up and decided to to take this and to um, create something different to keep this foundation in the flow to to make biotouch more accessible um, as you were talking about those um, uh, the virtual trainings we get to the world now um, right. In a way that we were never, and the board decided, let's do this. Right. Because more than ever, BioTouch is needed in this world. And you know, it works. I mean, it just works. I, I mean, I, I can't even tell you, folks. <laughs> it works. Yeah, it works. <laughs> you know, it could just be a simple uh, sinus clogged up. It could be a little infection. It could be major pain. It could be you tweaked your back. You could be dealing with major medical situations. It works. If nothing else, and the research shows it, it will reduce your stress. It will give you a moment to, you know, we have a woman, she's been coming in for years, this is very inspiring. And she was just diagnosed with breast cancer. Young, young lady, has two children, three children now. Um, and the beautiful thing that's happening is the, the family's dealing with this crisis is the younger daughter who I think is 13 or 14 now, keeps going up to mom and going, Mom, do you need some BioTouch? Oh, my gosh. Is that the epitome of what we're doing here? I, I told this young lady, you tell your daughter thank you. Yeah. Thank, thank her so much from Paul to help, to help me help his mother, her mother, to help her help her mother. And the sense that she has while they're dealing with this crisis of empowerment for this young girl oh, yeah, to yeah, help yeah. mom is that's what this is about I folks know. and we've talked about that many times um, and but to actually see it um, in action um, 
to see it actually working out the, the potential of what's there for the families yes. that this beautiful young girl can you know participate in this journey with her mom and not just feel you know kids anyway feel kind of useless sometimes but to actually be able to help her mother and do something for her mother that is uh, that just blows me away what a gift so again like it says we're teaching people to take responsibility for their own health care empower them to assist others and commute commun uh, create that community of people worldwide because we are the family humanity is the family yes you know and so we we start these little these waves of love that come in we begin with that family unit um, mommies daddies grandmas and all you know kitties and all this stuff and what happens then then each of us is is really capable and of going outside of that and you know ex extending that gift out of our family cores into our family members in the greater humanity this is the one thing that I always you know um, like those two ladies in Oregon they're doing BioTouch together. Right. They're, hey, Bev, uh, how about this, uh, you know, press firmly on the lower abdomen. And, <laughs> oh, my gosh, are we doing, you know, are we doing this right? And, you know, they become members and they're helping each other and helping their own families. They are a prime example of beginning with their families and then moving it out into their community, the greater humanity. That's that's what really what's in the offing here for us now. And I always liked that word community. Back in my hippie days, we always used to say community. It's come unity. Yeah. Unity. Let's come together now. You know, we don't we don't need uh, to be dissociated from one another. You no know, one. banging into one another. You know, judging one another. I mean, it. Let's share BioTouch. Put it on your Facebook page. Put it on your YouTube shares. Put it, put it everywhere you can. Send this email that you're going to get out to other people. Let's get this out to people so that they can understand there is some hope. And it's simple. It just takes these two fingers. If you haven't learned BioTouch yet, it's just these two fingers that lightly touch on the body. You know, yeah, this is an invita invitation from us. You know, if the next time somebody in your life says, oh my gosh, this is happening or that's happening and I wish this, you, you, you've got to know that you have something that you can offer. That, that just changes the whole dynamics of your relationship with that person. Because you, you, when you start doing BioTouch, you've entered into a whole nother realm of a relationship. It's, it's totally a loving presence honoring each other. Because as you were saying, we're too busy getting into each other's business and criticizing and judging. That's got to end people. Yes. <laughs> and BioTouch is one of the ways, I'm telling you. Because it's just about simple love. A simple application yeah. of that golden rule. Doesn't matter your belief system doesn't matter what side of the spe spectrum you live on, it will work no matter what. And our goal here in these Monday shows is to inspire all of us to keep doing it. You can go to our website, justtouch.com, even biotouchhealing.com. You can write us an email, office at justtouch.com, send out the podcast, send out the videos to people. You, you know, we are just... If Ask nobody's finding us, it's not our fault. Right. We've got it covered. We've got it covered on every <laughs> yeah. avenue. We've been doing some great SEO work, and we found out we get Google ads $10,000 a, a month. We're going to use Amazing. it. We're going to get it out there. This is a new beginning for it us. Is. Bev is. is back in town. Yay. We have now physical togetherness. We are going to move this thing forward, and we need your help. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. So, thank you all for joining us again. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Yay. She will be with us every other week, and then we'll still be doing our Zooms together. We so, will. Again, if you'd like to be on the show with us or you have any questions, just let us know. Otherwise, we'll see you all next week. And have a glorious week.
I can feel the pain in sunshine or rain. So it's not caused by the weather, but it doesn't hurt that much. After I feel your loving touch, and we spend some time together. Take my pain away each and every day. You're an angel from heaven on high. Your butterfly touch helps me heal so much, and I get better as time goes by. Take my pain.